to my channel welcome back to a brand new video today is incredibly exciting myself and mr carrington have done a very festive gift swap this year we have done a previous couple of challenges before so i'll leave them all linked below i'll also leave mr carrington's video that he is doing in collaboration with me essentially what we've done is we've had a budget of around about 20 pounds i think i went about 50p over for him where we have gone out to charity shops our local ones and i have sent ewan's package to him to open on camera and he has done the same for me now this box actually arrived a couple of days ago so it's been patiently sat waiting i haven't seen what's inside i wanted to unbox it on camera with you guys as well so that we can see what he picked up for me so if you're excited for this video give it a thumbs up make sure you are set and ready with your festive drink i went for a gingerbread latte with all the trimmings obviously so without further ado let's get on with this video i'm going to put the camera back a little bit i kind of wanted to incorporate my new christmas tree which i did a decorate my christmas tree video with me so make sure you check that out if you want to see how i created this very white glass minimal white company-esque uh, Christmas tree then be sure to check that out and if you are coming over from Mr. Carrington's channel hello welcome my name is Freya I do around two to three videos every week I love interiors I love bargains so I love shopping dupes and doing DIYs for some of the brands that I love such as the White Company, Anthropology. I'm just a big bargain hunter okay I love a bargain okay I'm gonna go grab some scissors and get in to this Oh! Hashtag thrift challenge, hashtag Xmas 2019. Uh, he also got me a cute little card. Rocking around the Christmas tree. I feel like if you ever need to get into the festive mood, I've just been asking Google to put on Michael Bublé's Christmas album. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. I took a few gambles. Wishing you a very Merry Christmas and an amazing 2020. Massive congrats on 50k. Thank you so much, Ewan. Uh, I know how hard you work and it's so deserved. That'll be very much you soon. <gasps> oh. Okay, first item. It's a box. There we go. Oh my god! Oh, this is so exciting. My mum used to do this to me. She'd like put a few prezzies in a box. So let's get into this. What's it gonna be? Is it gonna be a Christmas decoration? Like a bauble of some kind, maybe? I don't know why I like to guess what an item is before I open it, rather than just open it. It is! And oh my god, look how perfect it goes in my tree! Oh, Right, okay, so this is going to be going straight on my tree. And let's see, oh, it's originally Laura Ashley. Cute, I can't see if it's from which charity shop. Let's find a home for this one. Oh my Tom said it won't be long before this tree topper falls off and it just did. I need it, like this is such a weighty tree topper. I need something a bit lighter or a stronger tree. So pretty and perfectly themed. Okay, so next item. I think I saw this from last year. Okay, so I need to get a little hanging thing to go on it, but again, neutral nice and glass white simple so this will perfectly fit on one of these branches somewhere i'm just gonna get a little piece of string to put that on later but that is so cute no well no well okay this has to be a mug and if it is you and i tried so hard to find you a good mug but i found it quite limiting i'm not gonna lie <gasps> oh so pretty. I can already tell I'm gonna love. Oh, it's from Starbucks. Have you thrifted these items or have you just gifted me these items? Because they don't have prices on you in. Have you done a sneaky? And have you just, someone's cleaning their kitchen and they can see me. Oh my God. Yeah, because there's no price on this. Ewan, have you just gone out and bought these? Oh my God, I love this so much. If you found this in a thrift shop, I will be so impressed. I need to watch your thrift with me Christmas shopping, but he said I couldn't watch it until I've filmed this video because apparently a couple of the items were featured in that video. I actually love this 
so, so much. This is like my new favorite festive mug. <laughs> okay, first box is done. Next item. Oh, he's so cute how he's wrapped everything. Oh my God, have you done all of this for 20 pounds as well? So far. Okay, next item. Unless if we were meant to be taking off the prices, because I haven't, so sorry, you know. I am that person that leaves on the price of everyone's Christmas gifts. I just always forget, and then you see them open, and you're like, oh, let me just quickly grab that off you and just take the price off you. Oh, what's this? Is it a little jug? Oh, that's so cute. I love, okay, so this has got a price on it, $3.99 from anthropology as if you found something from anthropology you and you've done amazing so far and i'd be happy if it just stopped now honestly how nice is this this would be good as a little vase it could be a little jug i just think it's pretty as an ornament on itself to be completely honest with you so cute it's like an owl this could be quite nice at like festive time to have this out you know like autumn into winter so thank you so much, Ewan. I love it. Okay, so next up, we have a book. Is it a book? Yeah, maybe. Oh, oh my God. I saw this in a thrift shop near me recently and I nearly bought it. It's Louise Pentland, which if you don't know, she is also a YouTuber, so I've always wanted to read this. Oh my god, yes! Okay, so this is also reduced from £3.99 down to just a pound. What a bargain. Oh my god, I'm gonna love this. I cannot believe that I very nearly bought this at a charity shop the other day. I can't believe it. And I was like, oh, do I, don't I? But because I'm part of a book club, I listen to books on Audible, so that's the only reason why I didn't pick it up. But now I've got it, I'm definitely gonna read this and maybe even take this to South Africa with me which I'm going in December, so after Christmas. Okay, we have another item here which feels very much like a book, so let's get it open and see what is inside. Oh, and this one as well, oh my God. Okay, so Fern Cotton has a book called Happy, Finding Joy in Every Day and Letting Go of Perfect. This has like been hyped up quite a lot and talked about quite a lot, I've never read it, so I'm excited to give it a read. It's from Scope and it was three pounds. It's in like perfect condition. Mm. And I feel like this is really important for someone in our industry as well because it's very hard to switch off doing this job, especially as it's like a hobby as well. So it's quite nice to have something to do in terms of reading without needing technology and I feel like this is one of those books that, that will just sort of reset your mind and I don't know just give you a bit more of a happier outlook and a bit of a positive mental attitude. Happiness, you gorgeous warm ray of sunshine, I love it when you spring up out of nowhere and take me by surprise and how you can make clouds part and corners of mouths lift. That is so cute, thank you so much. And then we have, oh this is a double whammy this one two presents wrapped up and is it clothing maybe should we see oh nice this is like a little blouse from zara it is very zara you can tell i feel and it has a gorgeous like animal print snake print i like how sheer it is i feel like i'd wear this in christmas like a bit of a more evening do with some maybe black jeans black leather pants some heeled boots it is in immaculate condition little gold details as well which i love and this was from trade and it was four pounds but reduced from 8.99 so he's obviously been bargain shopping and found some good sale finds i love this i can't believe it's thrifted it literally feels like it's brand new okay and the other item which feels like it might be clothing oh nice it's again another kind of like kind of animal print it's very do you know what i was just about to say this print is very like michael kors inspired i've just seen the label michael kors your charity shops are incredible ours are like pants compared to yours okay so this 
Michael Kors little blouse top with a zip up back. Again, nice with leather pants. How have you found this? $17.99 reduced to four pounds. So yeah, Michael Kors top, I would imagine to be more like the 17 pounds in our charity shops, but to get it for four pounds, that is a huge steal. What a bargain hunter. I feel like for the first time ever, someone beats me as a bargain hunter. You have found some amazing bargains. Okay, last but not least, we have this item here. This is the biggest one at the bottom. Save it till the end. Oh, I love it already. It is a photo frame, if you can't already tell. Sorry, I'm like so invested in like opening this present. So it's one of these like hanging ones. Let me open it. And I've actually been after more gold frames because I've kind of windled out of silver out of my house. Um, and yeah, gold is like my preferred metal of choice. So this would look great. I feel like this is gonna go in our spare room. I have some um, photos, spare photos of me and Tom actually that we could put this up with. Oh, it's, or it could be a nice little, get some inspirational quotes to put in and have in an office. It's actually originally from Ikea. Gotta love Ikea. And it was pound fifty. Oh my God, I'm so pleased with everything. I actually think this is my favorite, honestly. I was so disappointed in the mug selection of our local charity shops that this is my favorite. Actually, no, Michael Kors top, a Zara top. But then the Louise Pentland book that I was nearly gonna buy. I love it all. Thank you so much, you and you did amazing. I hope you like everything that I picked out for you. If you guys wanna see what I picked out for you and then make sure that you click the link in the description box, head over to Mr. Carrington's channel and see what I picked out for him. So now I am going to enjoy finishing off my gingerbread latte, if you can see it in there. I hope you enjoyed this video, this thrift challenge, and last time I said if we smash 1,000 likes, we'll do another collab, which you guys did. So let's see if we can get to another 1,000 likes on this video. Thumbs up if you like the challenge videos and the collaborations that we do, and I hope to see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.